Richard Dad, you are required to be at Olympic Park at exactly 10 to 5 in the morning. <laughs> Start time, 5 o'clock. That means you should be rolling out of bed at about 10 to 4, I imagine. What about Mr. Wan? Mrs. Wan, Mr. Wan, what are you going to do? Connor, will Mr. Wan be able to run 4.5 miles to school next week? Mr. Wan! Will Mr. Wan be able to run 4.5 miles next week? Do you not think she's got the determination to do it? No! She might be very determined to take a taxi at all. <laughs> Give me a percentage, what's the percentage chance of them making it all the way without stopping? Zero percent! <laughs> <laughs> Zero percent, Yes. Um, well, Mr. Dad? Sure. Mr. Dad, yes. Yes. But not Miss Hollingbury? Yes. No. Both of them. Why no. not Miss Hollingbury? Yes. No. Yes. No. She's as tall as him! No, but, 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 no, I don't think. Hello. Counting my the Mr. Dad, Dad legs. is so fast, legs. Legs. Mr. Dad is so fast, that doesn't matter. <laughs> Why do you think no? What do you think, Travis? I'll say no because it's miles away. And plus, you probably run out of breath if you didn't get to me. <laughs> so, who's, who's, what do you think will happen if we run out of breath? Uh, you give up. And what will happen then? Because we're going to be, we've got to get to school. Um, we'll get for, uh, no, not for the... We're stuck in the middle of nowhere. We're <laughs> stuck in the middle of nowhere, we'll be late for goodness how long. <laughs> so will you two be impressed if they make it all the way to school? Yeah, I give them a pound each. Pound each? There's 24 people running, Travis. Just 24 pounds. <laughs> Only 24 pounds give. Okay, you're on camera saying that. Definitely, without a doubt. It's a tough run, but you know they've got it in them. I've got 100% confidence in you because you're young, you're fit, you are, you are the real deal. I mean. So impressed. You can do it. And what, what advice would you give the runners for Friday? Work with each other. Stay motivated. And just be positive and you'll make it no matter what. Just keep going. Think of the finishing line. <laughs> My advice is to keep hydrated and just keep thinking positive thoughts. My advice is to quit if you're not uh, up for it. <laughs> My advice is to keep going no matter what happens. My advice is to stop. Do not stop running. My advice to the runners is pace yourselves. You don't want to get tired when you're halfway through the race, you know. You're, you're crawling on the ground, wanting some water, you know. You don't want to do that. So yeah, pace yourself. My advice to the runners is to not stop running. My advice is to keep hydrated. The best piece of advice is don't do it. It's a mistake. Why would you want to run that when you've got a car? Don't do it. My advice on how to run. <laughs> I haven't got any. I've never done it. No, no, no. Um, just be like, um, keep your legs up. <laughs> Good morning. My name is George Cal. That's Jennifer Harvey. Hello. Minas Jana. Richard Dad, Angus Williams, Craig James, and we are going to run to Hayes, which is somewhere over there, about 24 miles away. It's all in aid of Habitat for Humanity, which want to raise £42,000 this year, and we're hopefully going to raise £3,000 from this event. <laughs> go, go, go!
That is, if you want to see a man who sweats a lot, <laughs> Mr. Dobson up there. Whereabouts is Africa are we going? Uh, Durban. Durban, South Africa. Oui. And how much have you got to raise, Miss Bruce? 42,000 pounds. <laughs> it's 42,000, Miss Bruce. Mr. O'Byrne, massive work, great stuff. Woo! Amazing, right? Off to Hewins, I need to go get my bike. Sunset, still the rising yes, silence. That is Chloe McCoy. There's no rain time. on roof, the grapes and beats me. My favourite tree breaking, light to pieces. Sprinkling, sharded, light on me. Throw a stone as hard you can. Hearing with hand, not hear it loud. Yeah. What would you like to say? I'd like to say well done to all the teachers who ran, especially Mr. Cal. And you've raised a lot of money for Habitat for Humanity, so well done. Favourite tree breaking, light to pieces Sprinkling, sharded, light on me Throw a stone as hard you can And hearing with hand, not hear it land Nothing taxing, dusting sand My window and world spins and twirls The walls then fall, I recall the saw White clouds whitewash, faded, spotless The weighty shadows, ranges of rocks Cold is all illusion thought up A stroll on shore, snooze and explore All possibilities in each new morning Till satisfied reaching out and yawning Fish in a big dish, rice and spice Salt over shoulder, never salt is so tight The truth I've told was silence sometimes But whose soul does not hide any crimes Wrapped in walls, encircled by work the walls fall, this story